Enterprise Edina is brought to you by the Edina Chamber of Commerce. Hello, welcome to Enterprise Edina, a program where we connect you to businesses in our community. I'm your host, Lori Severson, and today we're at the Edina Art Center. This is a place where you can come in and view the art and enjoy it, but it's also a place where you can actually create the art. Why don't you follow me and let's take a look. We're here with Michael Fry, General Manager at the Edina Art Center. Michael, thank you so much for joining us today. We appreciate it. You're welcome, Lori. It's my pleasure. You know, the Art Center has an amazing history. Can you tell us a little bit about that? I'd be happy to. We were um, donated to the city of Edina back in 1976. The home was built in the 40s by a Mr. Lee Miller, and Lee Miller was the owner of Gay T Glass, Stained Glass Company in Minneapolis. So it's an interesting story. The house is built like a bunker downstairs. We are about 10,000 square feet. We've had a couple of additions, and the home is built to last. Mm -hmm. The floor we're standing in right now is our gallery space, living room and dining room of the original home. And what you see, the marble on the floor, is the original um, bathroom separators from a building in downtown Minneapolis. So we have quite an interesting history. It is very interesting. You know, the one thing I love about the Edina Art Center is that it's not just a place where you can come to see the beautiful art, but you can actually create it. You can participate in it. Right. So we are a programming facility and we have a history of education. So we teach classes in pottery, drawing, painting, ceramics, jewelry making, and we are for ages 4 to 104. That's the age range that we go for. And we've had um, someone who was 100 years old who came into this facility taking a drawing class and it was great. A wide age range. And you don't necessarily have to have any experience, correct? No, I mean, you all different We get levels? a lot of people that have no experience whatsoever. So it's really nice to work with those people. And our instructors are well suited and skilled to teach new beginners. talk a little bit about the community overall. This is a very accepting community it is. of it's, art, and it's, it's a, a part of our history. It is, and that, it's a wonderful community to be um, the general manager of an arts facility. We have many exciting programs like Music in Edina, our public art program, the Edina Film Festival, that um, this community has a rich history of supporting the arts, and they feel that um, their tax dollars are well worth supporting the arts. So exactly. it's a great environment. Michael, you also do a lot of behind the scenes work with some um, projects and events here in Edina. You know, as if there wasn't enough going on at the Art Center itself with all our classes and workshops, I'm involved as um, the executive director of the Fall Into the Arts Festival. The Fall Into the Arts Festival takes place at Centennial Lakes Park here in Edina. We work with Centennial Lakes staff and we have what one artist called one of the most beautiful art fairs in the country. Right along the lake in Centennial Lakes we have about 250 artists, vendors, sponsors and it's a great time of year in September mm -hmm. so we look forward to that. Well, it's always been a popular event and it's growing every year. It is. We have about 12,000 people that are estimated come to the festival and then in uh, spring we take part in the Edina Art Fair so um, where we have two booths we have a demonstration booth and the clay demonstration booth is always really popular with the kids. Kids just love to come up and watch the potters um, spin that wheel and they are just mesmerized by the work that's made. So. And if you don't want to wait for the spring art show or fall into the arts but you're looking for a piece of art, you do have pieces for sale here, correct? We do. Our gallery, we have nine exhibitions every year where all the artwork is for sale. And then we have our gift shop and our gift shop hosts about 270 local and regional artists some of the most beautiful handmade items, and they're all for sale. Huge selection. Huge selection. 
Yeah. Michael, thanks so much for joining us. We appreciate it. My pleasure. If our viewers would like more information on the Art Center, how can they find that information? You can always go online, check out our website, edinaartcenter.com, and you can find all our class information online. That's wonderful. Thanks again. And thank you for joining us on Enterprise Edina. I hope you'll come back next month. Until then, enjoy Edina. Enterprise Edina is brought to you by the Edina Chamber of Commerce.